Steve, another fight, another win. Um, what did you think of your performance in that man? Uh, I thought it was good. Um, you know, quick. We always like the quick finishes. Um, you know, I'm happy. I'm happy I'm going home unscathed. I'm happy that we're both not hurt. I'm happy that uh, you know had the opportunity to go out and do what I love again. So um, yeah, I'm ready to line up the next one. And I know it's nice to get a quick paycheck. Is there part of you that's like, oh, I wish the fight went a little longer. I could, I could get some, uh, you know, more work in and test my skills there. No. Um, no, I come in here to uh, get the job done. They don't, uh, they don't pay me overtime. They don't pay me. Uh, you know, we don't have a we don't have a special bonus for making the fight go as long as we possibly can. So why not just get in and get out? No, that's, that was a resounding no. But uh, in, in terms of uh, well, in case there was any confusion, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. In terms of your next uh, your next move, I mean, what, what do you think? You're in the top ten. The rankings came out. I'm yeah. sure that was exciting. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm learning. If I've learned anything about this game, um, it's that, you know the numbers don't mean anything. The numbers really they really don't. And um, you know it's cool to like. Get recognition for for the hard work and you know whatever and being able to do things, um, you know. In the I, I've been been in the sport for a long time, you know, like, and it's it's finally to finally have that, you know, whatever. Like a little bit of recognition is cool, but uh, but like I said, you know, I fought <clears throat> I fought a lot of tough guys who had good records, whose numbers were impressive, whose stats were impressive. Um, and then you know on the vice the, the flip side of that, I'm sure my numbers are impressive and my stats are nice, but. You know, guys are coming to take me out too, and so you know, the longer I dwell on it, I feel like uh, the less the less actionable for fighting it is. You know, I, I just try to get better as a fighter between every fight, and uh, you know, I think I think today I kind of showcased that. With the rankings, I mean, you kind of have a roadmap to the title. There's a bunch of people in front of you, and you got to get to the top. So, is there anybody in those rankings above you that you would like to fight next? Um, well, there's two guys, two guys in the heavyweight division I won't fight, <clears throat> and one guy that you'd have to make a, a really you have to make it mean something, but um, no, I'm at the point now where I'm, I'm just ready to I'm ready to take fights and ready to take people out. Thanks, we'll take a couple more questions here, Jay. Hey, uh, so congrats on the uh, win tonight. Uh, just to clarify on that last answer, who are the two guys uh, that you won't fight? Uh, Linton Vassell and Matt Mitrio. Fair enough. And, you know, you didn't take a lot of damage the other night, like you said. Is the hopes to get maybe a quick turnaround after this one because you didn't come out on the scene? Yeah, we'll see. Um, I'm uh, having a kid in July, so I'd like to, you know, either get a quick turnaround or I'd like to have, you know, some, some time to fully focus on being a new father. So, um, you know, we'll see what happens. Uh, but my phone will be on, so... Congratulations on being a new dad. And last one for me. You mentioned that the uh, the numbers don't mean anything. If the numbers don't mean anything, how do you go about separating yourself from the rest of the pack and standing out in the division? Beating people up. Sam. Hey Steve, congratulations on an incredible performance here tonight. The uh, heavyweight divisions in general, you know, the divisions that tend to age a little more gracefully, perhaps, than some of the lower weight classes, you know. Uh, a lot of guys, you know, later in their careers still compete at a high level. And here you are, you know, knocking people out left, right, and center still in your 20s. As well as having, obviously, an incredible amount of skill. Do you think that youthfulness, being fresh, being young and explosive, not having taken as much damage as other people, do you think that's something that sets you apart and makes you a force to be reckoned with? Yeah, kind of. Um, but I, I'd also say that, like, you know, the two names that I said before, they're, they've been big, and they're not the only ones. I've, you know, I've had uh, literally a whole team of people, you know, um, and I'm, that I'm very grateful for to, you know, guide me along the way. So I think um, if, I, if I'm going to, you know, use my youth as uh, in a credit, or, like, rather say my youth is, is helpful in one way or the other, I'm going to say that uh, I'm going to say that my youth is good because um, I get to be around people who've, who've been in the game a long time, who can kind of steer me away from things that they thought weren't good or you know weren't productive and um you know i'm <clears throat> i'm sure they'd be happy to tell you that uh i'm grateful to hear it from them but uh you know that said i i really like uh i, I mean i love fighting there's nothing i really love more than, than getting in there and getting down so uh i'm really looking forward to, to making the most of the years ahead and you know if that's that if i wake up tomorrow and decide i don't want to fight anymore I, that that's my calling that's what's going to happen but you know if I, if I have another 10 12 years in the pipeline then you know, I think I'll make the most of that too. Enjoy this victory, my man. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, last one here, Santiago. Hi, Steve. Congratulations on a beautiful performance. Thank you. Scott Coker said that an interim belt is coming for the heavyweight division. Are you happy to see that the division is getting set to move on? Yes. Um, I mean, Ryan Bader's doing his thing, so 
good on him. But uh, yeah, the rest of the division is where we got a bunch of dudes who are a bunch of dudes who are climbing, a bunch of dudes who are waiting for their shot. And um, you know, it's good to see that there's going to be some momentum. So uh, you know, best of luck to you know Ryan doing his thing. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy to see that there's there's going to be some some shaking in our division. Enjoy the victory, sir. Thank you. Thanks, Steve. Appreciate your time. Thank you, guys.